Right now, dozens of dreamers and supporters are gathering on the Auraria campus here in Denver since the debate on DACA is still unresolved. Government officials have until March 5th to come up with a plan to keep the program continuing. Denver 7's Jason Grenauer is live on the Auraria campus tonight. And Jason, there's a lot of uncertainty out there. A lot of uncertainty, some anxiety yet resolved. Just as the sun went down a few minutes ago, this kind of rally vigil just wrapped up, but they came together with posters like this demanding or asking in some cases Dream Act now. They simply want protection. We'll show you some video from just about 30 minutes ago when there were a few dozen people here on the Auraria campus. There was some chanting, there was some singing. They want some type of permanent resolution out of the federal government. The DACA program, the DREAM Act, whatever it may be, because of all of that uncertainty right now, in the next few weeks will determine a lot of that. The president's self-imposed deadline of March 5th for Congress to act. I have no idea um, where Congress is at any given moment. I check the news every five minutes to see where they are in these negotiations, to see whether they've added in poison pills that will make my parents more deportable. So I'm in a constant state of anxiety. Um, not knowing what Congress is going to do and how that's going to affect me. And of course, immigration reform was a big part of that most recent government shutdown that was then resolved without any permanent resolution. So what does Congress do over the next few weeks? Is it some type of dream act? Is it funding a border wall? Is it some combination of all of these things? In the meantime, these people thought, thought it best to just come together while they simply have to just wait it out. Reporting live on the Auraria campus tonight, I'm Jason Grenauer, Denver 7.